Hello, welcome back to JB Cooks. My name is JB and in this video we're going to cook pancakes in a cast iron skillet. And not just any pancakes, I'm going to make some chocolate chip ones. Uh, first, just need to go ahead and preheat this stove to low. I want to keep it low and let this preheat for about 20 minutes. While that's preheating, we'll go ahead and get the ingredients ready uh, from scratch so we can get these pancakes on this uh, cast iron skillet. So I'm going to start off, I've already got one and a half cups of flour in this bowl here. And we're going to go ahead and add all our dry ingredients, uh, two teaspoons of baking powder, one half teaspoons of baking soda, about a half teaspoon of salt, and I'm going to add about two tablespoons of sugar. And just go ahead and stir all those dry ingredients all up nicely so it's all mixed in good. Shake it around here. And then just kind of create a little well or a little hole in the middle. And I'm going to start to add some milk in here. I'm going to add about one and a fourth cups of milk right in here. And I'm going to mix that up real good. About one and a fourth cups. Might need to add about another fourth cup of milk here in a bit. We'll see to make the texture uh, like we like it. Let me go ahead and add in a couple of eggs. Add this one. And two. And I just so happened to get a little shell in there. Get the shell out, and then I'm gonna whisk that up. Just wanna get it uh, about the right texture here. You know what, we better add a couple, two or three tablespoons of melted butter. How about that? Throw that in there. Texture's looking pretty good there. I'm also going to want to go ahead and, uh, you don't have to do this, but I'm just going to add a squirt of vanilla, maybe a teaspoon, mix that in there. Looks like it's about the right texture. I don't know if I need any more milk. Uh, maybe a dash, let's just add a little bit of milk. Yeah, that looks lovely. So now we're going to go ahead and place these on the pan. Now I said I was making chocolate chip pancakes. You can very well pour all of the chocolate chips in here, maybe a half a cup to a cup of chocolate chips, and you can stir those in here and then put them on the um, pan. But I'm going to do it a little different. I'm going to pour them on the pan and then go ahead and add the chocolate chips. And that's also nice in case you have a, a two or three people that don't want chocolate chips while you're making pancakes. They can have it without them. So let's head over to the skillet and let's go ahead and start cooking. So it's been preheating for about 20 minutes now, and we're going to go ahead and just add a, oh, just a small amount of butter in here. And about a one-fourth cup of batter. Put that right in the center. You could actually get two on here if you wanted to. As I did a bit ago and messed up right here. But hey... Once it's done, it's all good. Not the perfect flip every time. So we're just gonna let that sit there for just a minute. And if you want the chocolate chips, just go ahead and add some of those right on this and let it kind of melt in there. Go ahead and wait until the bubbles start to form a little bit. I already see some bubbles forming there. It's not gonna take long, so let's just let that cook up for about 30 seconds or so and then we'll look under it. Kind of lifting up from the baking powder. 
Let's take a peek here. Yeah, so we can get under there. Shouldn't stick too much with that butter. And flip it. Mm, there we go. Not quite the best flip. But doesn't look too bad. Let that cook for just a few minutes. Actually, just a few seconds. Don't want to cook it too long. You can always kind of look in the center. Make sure it's good. There you go. Look at that. That side there looks nicely done. Got the chocolate chips in there. Do one more. Just add a little butter each time. Cook up really quick too. This time I'm just going to make a plain one, no chocolate chips. If you like just a little bit of chocolate chips and you want a couple of pancakes, add you one with chocolate chips, create you another one without chocolate chips, and you can, you know, top the one with chocolate chips below or above the regular one, and that way you don't get too many chocolate chips. You don't want a whole lot of them. Starting to see some bubbles form on this one. Let me give it just another second or so. Let's go ahead and flip it. That time I went ahead and waited long enough to where the juices aren't running off quite like I did on the last one. And there you go, and it's going to go ahead and cook up nicely. So now you can go ahead and place that plain pancake there if you like. Throw that chocolate chip pancake on top. Add you your favorite topping. So I'm going to add just a little bit of syrup. You could add whipped cream if you wanted. Let's place this on here. And look at that. Bacon and eggs goes excellent with this. Check out the video to the right of the screen if you want to make some bacon and eggs in your cast iron skillet as well to go right along with these wonderful pancakes.